For a while, it looked like the Ganga had found a saviour in Jairam Ramesh. The former environment minister firmly put the Uttarakhand government in the dock for failing to act against illegal mining. He threatened to turn 100 metres on either side of the river an eco-sensitive zone. This move would have given the centre exclusive right to regulate all development in the zone. No wonder the mining mafia is celebrating his exit as the Green Minister. Relentless quarrying on the banks of the Ganga near Haridwar is having catastrophic effect on the ecology of the area. The alarming rate of sand mining forced former Environment Minister Jairam Ramesh to deliver a warning to the state government. Put a stop to the rampant illegal mining or the Environment Protection Act will be invoked against the guilty. No wonder there is a sense of jubilation in Uttarakhand after Ramesh's departure from the Ministry of Environment and Forests. Not one to mince his words, Ramesh had pointed an accusing finger at the Uttarakhand government. January 10, 2010, को मैंने मुख्यमंत्री को खुद एक खत लिखा था, जिसमें मैंने ये रिपोर्ट उनको सौंपा और मैंने उनसे कहा कि ये गैर कानूनी खनन जो हो रहा है, अफसोस की बात है कि 18 महीने बाद राज्य सरकार की ओर से कोई कार्रवाई दिखाई नहीं देगी। the BJP simply says that it was the Congress that gave out the licenses to mine in the first place. In the 13 districts of the state, there are a total of 124 stone crushing units. 96 of them approved before 2007 when the Congress was in power. Jairam Ramesh Ji ka Uttarakhand Sarkar ke prati itna bhedbhav wala ravaiya hai. Unhone bina Ganga Basin Authority ke bina kisi scientific cause ke हमारी तीन जल विद्युत योजनाएं उन्होंने बंद कर दी मोरियाल साहब बागेश्वर जिले के रहने वाले हैं बागेश्वर का पूरा जो इलाका है रीमा नाकुरी इलाका उसमें पूरा सोप स्टोन के खाने हैं उसमें इस तरह की वाला खनन नहीं है few will contest though that uttarakhand now seems simply not interested in enforcement of the law 161040 cases of illegal mining were detected in 17 states of mainland India during 2006 to 2009. In the state of Uttarakhand, just 191 cases were detected. The ground reality, though, is very different. Illegal mining is the latest political ping pong between the Congress and the BJP. However, Activists campaigning for the Ganga only worry that Ramesh's exit doesn't push the issue to the back burner. Bureau Report, Headlines Today.